In this example, we're going to learn how to find the correlation coefficient in Excel. Correlation coefficient is also known as R value, and it ranges from positive 1 to negative 1. It tells you the strength and direction of the relationship between two sets of data or two variables. So here in this example, we have the number of people who use public transportation in a week and the number of people who use personal cars in a week. So we're going to see if the values in these data sets have a positive or a negative relationship. And we also want to know the strength of this relationship. So in Excel, we can use the C-O-R-R-E-L Corel function. So when you see your function, double click on it. First thing it's going to ask is array 1 and then array 2. So array 1 is your first data range and array 2 is your second data range. So this value of 0.69 tells me that they have a moderate positive relationship. If this was close to 1, then you can say that this has a very strong positive relationship. But since this is um, a little bit above 0.50, I would say it's moderately positive, but not very strong.